Sky Drone 5 over TPC Stonebray and Hayward, where Warrior star Steph Curry is trading the hardwood for a set of fairway woods. The two-time NBA MVP made his pro golf debut today at the Ellie Mae Classic. KPI X5's Katie Nielsen is there. Now, Katie, I'm guessing a lot of Warriors fans became big golf fans today. Oh, absolutely. There were more Warriors hats than there were Titleist golf hats, and the atmosphere felt more like Oracle Arena than it did a Web.com golf tournament. Steph Curry made the shot. Not a three-pointer, but a birdie. Curry finished four over par in today's first round at the Ellie Mae Classic. This, it was a day of first for everything. First, obviously, opportunity to play with these guys. Um, that first tee shot was crazy. Curry had a gallery of more than 500 people today, mostly decked out in Warriors gear. Well, this is uh, a little bigger than normal. Usually, the crowds are less than a dozen. Respect to the web.com and their athletes and uh, their level of golf, but we wouldn't be watching them play some golf unless Steph was out here. For some pint-sized fans like Chef Curry, it was the little moments that made his day like a high five from his hero. I felt like I was on top of the world. I felt like I got touched by God, basically. But even the superhuman have some nervous moments. When, as soon as he said my name on the first tee, that's when I, I, I could barely feel my hands. I had to take a, try to take a deep breath, and still it wasn't anything I could prepare myself for that moment. The pros he played with today said they didn't see those nerves. You know, a couple things that showed a lot of grit. I think that's awesome because it's exposing people to golf that wouldn't normally be exposed to golf. So. I think it's great for the game. There's so many fans out here. I've never been to a web event with this many uh, fans. Right now, Curry is tied for 144th place out of 156 players. That means he's going to have to shoot well under par tomorrow if he wants to make the cut so that he can advance to the final rounds this weekend. Live in Hayward, Katie Nielsen, KPIX5.